All right, Justin, some CCSD students are finally back in the classrooms as the district welcomes back kids from pre-K to third grade. 13 Action News reporter Jeremy Chen live at Rex Bell Elementary School with more on the excitement felt by students and teachers. Jeremy. Yeah, well, Dave, it was just like the first day of school for everyone at the school, whether you were a teacher, a student, or even a parent, and the sense is that this is could be the start of getting some sense of normalcy back. The school bell at Wenger Elementary School rings as students return for the first time this school year, greeted by staff with balloons and music. My hope for today is just that they feel welcome back and that they're looking forward to finishing out the school year like this. For parents, the thought of returning to school was scary at first, but they're happy distance learning is coming to an end. I was a little nervous at first, but I think that we have to kind of, you know, get back to school and uh, let them interact a little and, you know, be a kid. Principal Kim Swoboda says about 40% of her kids will be back in the classroom with the rest staying virtual. She's happy to now see students in person to help build better connections between them and her teachers. Let's face it, we all went into education to be with kids and to teach kids and so for us it's just so exciting to have them back on campus and to be able to help them. At Rexbell Elementary School, the school day started with the Pledge of Allegiance, the first time students recited it together in person, adding a sense of normal in an otherwise abnormal time. You know, this is uh, it's a learning curve, but our teachers are up to it as far as the, uh, the, the, hybrid, uh, the hybrid model. A learning curve some teachers say they'll be working through with their students. This whole year, the kids have been incredible and patient, and they like understand they're, we're all in it together, so I think that they'll be understanding. Now, older students will be coming back into the classroom later on this month in CCSD, and by next month in April, we're expecting to see kids from pre-K all the way through fifth grade to come back to full-time learning in person at CCSD schools. Jeremy Chen, 13 Action News.